clean these uh, all white 270 Nikes. So what I'm gonna do the pretty basic method. Uh, just a bit of water. I just used this. It's not a specific measurement. It's just you want an equal amount of everything. So now we're gonna add the uh, baking soda. This is gonna be just three ingredients. Baking soda, water, and hydrogen peroxide. And then I already have water in the cup. Alright, now let's dry this off so the baking soda doesn't get stuck on it. And now we're going to add the baking soda. Alright, and then I'm going to be using a toothbrush. You could just use a normal piece of cloth, but a toothbrush is more convenient. So I'm going to mix it up. Make sure you mix it up nice and well. And towards the bottom of the mixture, it will become a paste type material. Make sure before you clean your shoes, you take off the shoelaces. You'll most likely just put them in the mixture, mix them around, and then once they're done drying, shake off the extra stuff. There are other methods to do this, and if it's not getting too uh, paste enough, you can always add just a little bit more baking soda. It's just make sure you add like about half of the baking soda you put with hydrogen peroxide. Go power mode. Mix it up. Alright, and once you feel you got a good enough mix, then you can start getting on the shoes. So you're probably going to want to let it sit for a little bit, get the paste. So we're just going to let it sit for a little bit. See, it's a pretty paste. So that's good. If you need to, you should dump out any excess water or liquid. <coughs> All right, just get some on the toothbrush. Not a crazy amount and not too little either. What's up? Well, you're so cleaning it better than that other guy. I am. <laughs> See, not too much, not too little. And then boom, you're just gonna start scrubbing away. And as I scrub, you can look to look at these shoes. I only cleaned one, not the other one. And as you can see, there's such a huge noticeable difference. That's because this method is really works. I wanted to try them on my work shoes before I used my nice shoes. Cause I don't wanna just go straight into ahead of this and then make them like just completely jack up my shoe. Cause nobody wants that to happen. I'm going to show you just one more time. The right shoe is the clean one. The left shoe is not the clean one. As you can see, it's not. It's, these are not going to completely remodel your shoes. Your shoes are always going to stay semi-dirty. It's just it makes them so much cleaner, and you'll have a little bit more confidence while wearing them. This is just a DIY 
type thing. It's not a legit, like, if you want to clean your shoes, clean your shoes. Either just buy a whole new pair or buy that fancy smancy crap on the internet. But nobody wants to do that. So, we're over here DIYing it. Make sure you scrub it in nice and good. All right. So right here, all I'm doing is just, you know, wiping the shoes. This is only gonna take about, you know, five minutes. Um, as you're scrubbing, you're gonna see a lot of like, things come off. They're gonna look a little pasty and stuff. That's normal. You just wanna make sure that you get the majority of it on there and then Make sure you scrub it nice and nice uh, all over the shoe that is nylon right. and meshed. And then once you get done, you're going to want to let these dry for about two, four hours. Um, yeah, it's quite a bit of time, but you really want the stuff to sink in, sink in and really clean it out and get it nice and clean. And then once you're done, you're going to want to really pound them and, uh, you know, get all that extra stuff out it gets under there but all you got to do is just hit it out and once you do that yeah all right and then now with the extra stuff you have left over you're going to want to get your shoelaces and just dump them in there Mix it up some. Just get it all over it. You can always add more stuff. Just make sure it's even. Just mix it up. Get it all over your shoelaces. Really clean them up. Remember, like I said, you don't have to use a toothbrush. It's just, you know, better. You can always just use a paper towel or a, you know, normal dishcloth. And then just like the shoes, you're gonna let these dry out for, you know, hour, four hours, two hours. It doesn't matter where, it just, they need to be air dried. They could be outside or inside, it doesn't really matter. Just when you're outside, you may have the help of a breeze or something, the sun, but you also have that chance of getting, you know, dirt on them. And you would think like, what's the point of cleaning them if I'm just gonna get that dirt on there. So you might wanna take them inside, but like I just said, doesn't really matter so yeah all right guys these are them afterwards as you can see they're not still perfectly white but they're way cleaner than they were the shoelaces did come out clean it's just I had an extra pair of black laces and I said I'll try them out and dang they look fire So yeah, just try that method. See if it works on your shoes. It should. Nylon shoes. Get the mesh off. Perfect. Remember, there's other methods. You can buy the specific product. Uh, if your shoes are all white, you can just bleach them. Make sure you put a little water in that bleach, though. Um, and yeah. Came out real nice. Like I said before, they're not perfect, but still. Now I can wear these feeling comfortable. And yeah. That's it guys, hopefully you found this useful. Yeah.